Hello and welcome to PlayStation Access, where I am playing my new favourite game, which Rob has picked out, yes. and he's here as well. Yeah. What is it, Rob? It's Final Fantasy IX. It's Ash's new favourite game. It's my new favourite game. She I'm doesn't a, even know it yet. I don't know. It's because it's got Mooglies in it. Mooglies. Mo Mooglies. Uh, that we're playing this. Yeah. So, well, you like cats. I do. I love cats. Do, I'm a, is day, a Moogly a cat, though? Every day we hear about it. Yeah, I love cats. I do. Here's my cat. Cats, cats, scrunge cats. <laughs> I do like scrunge um, cats. Stray's coming out soon. Yes. Ash is very excited about that. And I am. Ash has also made a lovely preview on Stray that we've got on the channel right now, if you haven't already seen it. Yeah. Um, but for a long time, Ash, I've wanted you to play this because I love it. It's Yeah. In my top five favourite games of all time. What are your top favourite games of all time? Final Fantasy VII, Metal Gear Solid, Vagrant Story, Final Fantasy IX, Skyrim. Oh, wow. You really have that to hand? Um, like, you really, really have that to hand? I was expecting you to be like... Oh, <laughs> oh, oh, oh. <laughs> and it's got really cute moogles in it, which are little cat-like creatures. Moogles. Who make cute little noises, and I think you will love them. And I think if you played this game, you would love this game. And that's why I'm here, through no choice of my own. <laughs> <laughs> and also here, loads of people in the chat. Yeah, hello. Hello, everybody. How are you? I'm just going to read out some names. Will Hess, Joanna, Claire Halliday, Toby says cats are the best. Cats are the best. Lucy Sobey's in the chat. Naomi Ford, Janita Pavlova, Sir Trevelot, Lorenzo Pierleone, Carl's. Cheers, Anakin. Welcome to you all. Welcome to the stream. Welcome, welcome. I'm sorry. I'm I'm so warm. It's very warm in the UK at the moment. So if warm, I look it? swampy, it's <laughs> it's <laughs> the lighting and also my sweat. Um, should I press go then, Rob? Yes. Should we go? Oh, I didn't press go. What's Did you happening? Not? What, what have you done? I must have pressed go. You must have done. <laughs> Did I press go? Start game. No, this is like the animation that they'll circle oh, back yeah. to the title screen. <laughs> so you can skip this. Okay. Now we're pressing you get. Okay, here we go. Okay. I'm expecting lots of cats in this, by the way. I hope you're not disappointed. I'm already disappointed. Why is there not a cat? Just watch. It's so exciting. This <laughs> it's a PS1 game. Look how good it looks. A PS1 game? Yeah. Those are that this is good. That is, is good. This is a PS4 version of it, but, but it's not like a remaster. It's just a port. This is what it looks like on PS1. Look at that cresting wave. Oh, it's so good. Look That's at proper that. sea. That's proper scary sea. Oh. Oh, the music. Oh, it's, making, it's almost making me cry. The music. Why? Oh my God! Because it just reminds me. Don't, don't do a dismissive <laughs> wrinkle of the face. <laughs> Why? <laughs> Shenpei asks, "Is this your first Final Fantasy game, Ash?" Yeah, it is. Yeah, I have never cracked into the Final Fantasy series because I never understood that the titling was separate games. I always thought there was like you know 15 Final Fantasies in the series. Um, obviously, I know that now. That's not the case, but. I don't know, like JRPG as a genre oh, know, has never pulled me in. I know, but this is this is the these are the games that even people who don't necessarily like JRPGs love because they're just amazing. And this is like Final Fantasy seven, VII, VIII, and IX, in my opinion. That was the golden era, just incredible. The the creativity coming out of SquareSoft, now Square Enix, at the time. Yeah, they were just on top of their game. So many incredibly talented developers. Here's here's your man. Sedan. Why has it got a tail? It just has. Is that explained? Yes, it is. Okay. Eventually. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. So I'm asking the right questions. Yeah. Here we go. Sure is dark. Do I have to voice this as well? No. Is there any voice acting? There's no voice acting. Okay, so I do have to voice it. You don't have to voice it. Sure is dark. You read it in your head. That's also the beauty of these games is that you play them almost like a novel. Like you read. Guess character. nobody's here yet. <laughs> I wish you guys could see Rob's face. <laughs> Just a face, over, hand over the face. Oh. <laughs> Lucy Sobey says simply, tail. 
Okay, so... Look, look at the Moogle in the top left. There you go. There's the first Moogle. Just the little menu Moogle telling you what to do. Look Ooh. at the little pom-pom on its head. Oh, it looks like a red nose day Moogle. That's what they all look like. They've all got little cute red noses. Are they all red? They're all pink like that. Actually, no, there's one, there's one special one throughout the game. Okay. Actually, no, I thought it was a yellow Moogle, but actually I think it's a Moogle wearing a yellow coat. Oh, that's cute. And it's called Stiltskin, and it goes around the game just delivering letters to other Moogles. It's Aww. like a post Moogle. That's nice. That is nice. Cards Moogle Square. Okay, let's see what that does. <laughs> Cards Moogle. <laughs> Square is the button you press to challenge people to the card mini game. Cards Moogle. Or when you're on the world map, you I'm call, pressing it. You could. You can't. You're not. You can't. <laughs> you don't have any cards yet, and there's no Moogle to sell. Moogle. Just <laughs> Light the candle in the middle of the room. This one. <laughs> I love how you have to just experiment. Shall I go down to my <laughs> cancel? <laughs> Who's there? Now you get to name a character. Oh, okay. And their name's Zidane. I say Zidane, but I don't know. Because just the isn't, cause isn't that a football player? The footballer, yeah. Zin Zinedine Zidane. Zinedine Zidane. So that's why I've always said Zidane. Oh, Some but you can name them whatever you like. Y yes. I don't. Oh, come on. <laughs> no, don't. <laughs> what should I name? What does triangle mean? Oh, just nothing. Okay. I don't know what... I'm going to I'm gonna behave because I, I, it would take me too long to think of something funny. Maybe I'll just... Uh, what can do I delete? G for Gary says, little known fact. Final Fantasy IX is set in Wolverhampton. <gasps> I'm not entirely sure that's Hi true. Hi, Wolverhampton. I'm going to call him. <laughs> I'm going to call him Beat, like a beetroot beat. <laughs> <laughs> Why? I'm going to name them all after food. Oh, I'm trying so hard not to be a, a gatekeeper. <laughs> Go on, well, beat. What have you it's done? me, beat. <laughs> what it's have me. you done? It's me, it's beat. <laughs> oh god, I, I should have learned. I should have learned <laughs> from Metal Gear Stupid to never, never make other people play my favourite games. Hey, beat. You sure are late. <laughs> I'm gonna name another character, Root. <laughs> beat. <laughs> Sorry. Where's the boss? Sinner. Ain't here yet. Oh, it is the boss. Surely with that hat. Is he part dragon or has he just got a hat on? Rob. Oh my god, are we fighting? Yes. Why? It's like, it's just the, you know, it's the intro. He's it's our how, boss? This is how you fight. See, the, this... Oh, okay. You can use your commands for each character when they're ATB... What's the ATB gauge? The ATB gauge is just the gauge. What's it, what's it stand for? It stands for? for Active Time Battle. It's a, okay. a thing that Final Fantasy sort of coined, and it's a mixture between turn-based and real-time. So instead of being like completely traditionally turn-based, where you literally have as much time as you want to input your actions, time does move throughout the battle. So when you get to the end, when you get to choose your move, Time is still going and enemies can okay. still attack you. Like oh, like in Final Fantasy VII where like you're doing slow mo. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Alright. So there you go. The green oh, bars beat is blanks <laughs> up. Here we go. Steal. I'm gonna steal. Oh, nice. I got a potion. Nice. What's that do? That heals you, so that'll go into your items menu now. And then I attack. Sinner is useless in this fight, I will say, and will probably die. Ah! Oh, he's fallen over. Ha! You fool! I keep up the pressure, I would. Yeah, he has. Um, he's got another item called a Mage Masher, which is quite a good dagger for this stage in the game, but it is quite hard to steal. So you could be here all day trying to steal it. Oh, I'm just smacking you him. You could at just the smack him. Yeah. Oh, like. okay. uh, let's all steal. Let's see what we can steal. I think he's only. Oh, I've stolen his wrist. That's, I've stolen his whole that's wrist. A, that's a bracelet. Oh. It's a bracelet. Oh, okay. <laughs> it's like a piece of armor. <laughs> I you could Keep just going, Ash. You got the time. Time's items. are wasting. You got to be quick on these inputs. I just took his whole so wrist. I think he's me. only got the mage masher left now, and it might take you a while to steal it. Give it me. It is worth it. Couldn't steal anything. Does it tell you when he's empty? He's going to kill Sinner. Oh, Sinner's really weak. Get some. So you could throw a potion on Sinner if you want. Oh, I attack. Oh, yeah. Got it! Okay, so go down to item. Yeah, beat. I want you to use potion. 
This one. Yeah. And on Sinner. There you go. Drink up, my friend. Now, how do I use my Mage Masher? You can't. You have to equip it outside of battle. So now it's just attack, attack, But it's attack. real time, Rob. But, yeah, just, just trust me. Now you can just attack him until he's dead. Okay. Attack my smack. hey -ya. He hasn't got much left. He's got, yeah. Ah! There you go. There you go. You Is go. That a what? You were correct. It was a. It was just a mask. <sighs> I knew. I knew. <laughs> that was well done. Thank you. You got. Use a potion to restore. You are the masked man, Rob. Yeah. <gasps> Oof, I wonder how Beat is faring. <laughs> woo woo woo, Baku. Hey, fools. I like his energy. Will he join my team? You're looking a lot better. Gua ha ha ha. Oh, I love Baku. He's the boss, yeah. 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 All right. Let's start this meeting already. Like, look at his personality. Just kicking that door open. I'd like to be like Baku. Oh, I love this so much. Look at them all. They're so cool. Here's the plan. This is how I've decided he speaks. Tantalus, the infamous band of daring thieves. That's us. Is heading to the kingdom of Alexandria. Our mission, to kidnap the heir to the throne, Princess Garnet. That's a good name. I'll take it from here, so listen up. <laughs> it's from Wolverhampton. Our it? ship's about to dock at Alexandria, and when it does, we're going to put on our costumes and perform I Wanna Be Your Canary, the most popular play in Alexandria. Break a leg, Marcus, because you're playing the lead. Leave the acting to me. Of course, the real kidnappers will be blank and beat. Oh, for God's <laughs> sake. I'll distract the audience from backstage with these little... Oh. You can say that word. No. Oh. <laughs> I can't stand oglops. They're little bugs. They're little bugs. Okay, but I'll manage, so don't worry about me. And that'll be your cue, beat. Oh, for God's sake. <laughs> Queen Bratlet. Yeah, I'm going to say that. You bet. You're going to kidnap... <laughs> Don't press that again. Does he say that again? <laughs> oh my goodness. You kidnapped the most babelicious beauty. I respect that more. Babelicious. <laughs> yeah, some of the lines have not aged well. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go, though. This is. Oh. Brings a tear to my eye. All of this. Ooh, boo hoo. Final Fantasy Nine. <laughs> it's, it's Phoebe. <laughs> Honestly, the, one of one of the greatest the top five top five Final Fantasy characters of all time. Why? What's he do? Well, you, have, you have to play the game through really to appreciate it. It's just amazing. You have to watch the first two seasons, then it starts to get good. Is what I'm hearing. No, you just have to play the game. <laughs> <laughs> You're about to control Phoebe. Okay. Is he part of my crew? Yeah. I think. I think I've read the whole plot to this. What? I could describe it to you, but I don't want to spoil it for the chat. I don't know. It might have been another Final Fantasy. Listen to the music. Don't you think the music's amazing? Okay. If I ask you, is this about time slipping? Is it this one? Mm, no. Okay. I haven't read this one, then. One of the games I read the plot for. One of the Final Fantasy games? Mm. I'm trying to remember which one is about time slipping. There's there's time there's time distortion and yeah. time compression in Final Fantasy VIII. That one. That's what I've read. Because they all go to like... They have to compress time yeah. to fight the evil sorceress from the future. That's it, yeah. Doing all the bad stuff. I, yeah. was, I, say, I didn't understand it, but I knew time was bad. And there was a princess and a queen and some wizardry. Alexandria. Get off me, child. Are you all right? Sam Aston asks, what year is this from? Um, 2001, I think, Final Fantasy IX came out originally on PS1. A Space Odyssey and Final Fantasy IX. Here! 2001, <laughs> Final Fantasy IX. <laughs> you dropped your ticket! Bye-bye! I'm sure in the original version, her line is dwopped, like it's an actual W in the word. Dwopped. You dwopped your ticket. And it looks like they've changed it to just plain old dropped. Look at him, little Vivi. Is this this child? I saw the nobles first. Oh, that means cards. 
Nikolai, nobles always come to Alexandria to see the annual performance. Give me a card. You've got to have at least five cards. To give me some then. How do I steal? Uh, I think you can get some cards pretty early on. What about this guinea pig? Why, you're no city child, and you aren't a noble child either. Yes? Oh, these street urchins are simply dreadful. What about you? Hello. Look at the that side. armor does not look very protective. It's very protective. <laughs> this gate leads outside. Let me out then. Bye. Oh, I can't leave. Look at the fish guy. Hello. Blub, 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 blub. Commoners like us have to watch the play from the rooftops far away from the stage. Oh, that's really sad. It seems to me like there's some class issues in Alexandria. Yeah. But don't you love all the all the animal people? I do, but I want to see some cats. It, so I think there's... um. Why is everyone running into me? Rat kid. <laughs> me. Why? you got to get out of my way. Man. Well, that's it for today. Time to get ready to see the play. You know what? Nobody's got any cards for me. Nobody's I got any crack. Is, I think you can go into one of the buildings on that street and okay. get some cards. Or maybe it's this building here. Honourable nobles of Treno, Castle Alexandria is this way. Nice. Is that a hippo? Yeah. Yeah. There's loads of different races in the game. Loads of different... I, that's what I, lo I love the whole medieval fantasy of this so much. It's Hello? so good. <gasps> Ashley! We'll sure be busy tonight. That is like me. <laughs> but it'll also be the last time we'll be so busy. We should play cards. Go and get it, lead. Okay. i got to get back to work. Go on then. I think that guy there gives you cards in the red coat. Male red match. I don't know why I'm depressed. <laughs> I have a ticket to see a great show. I should be happy. Pagliacci. <laughs> I'm wrong. He doesn't. Where did you get the cards? I know it's around here somewhere. It's very early on. I'm sure there was a guy in here who no. you how to play. Out my way. What's this cup? Uh, give me this cup. It looks like I can pick it up. Got something. Yeah. Got a card. Okay, so I just got to go you need everywhere. You five cards. Okay. I, uh, I, I'm, I'm sure there's someone who like gives you a bunch at the beginning. Uh, yeah. yeah. Some money. I got to say, I don't care about the story. I do care about playing cards. It's difficult to understand though when she, when she start playing. So I wouldn't worry about it too much. Okay, but I got to get to the cats. I've got to look. There's something there. A potion. God, I'm great at this. No. I'll be back for you, Ashley. Okay, oh, now I need to... Do you have some cards over here? <gasps> 33 gil! Look at these birds! Hello, how are you? Oof, I can't move, thank on you. On the street previous to this, there's a little house you can go in where you can rob a grandmother. Sorry, saving. hip all. Okay, I'm going to go rob a grandmother. That sounds fun. Let's see. So one of these houses off to the right, I think. Let's try this one. That looks housey. Nope. Let's try this move. Move. Nope. Let's try this one. Nope. There, yeah, I think on the right. On the right now. This one. Up. Uh, it might be that one yet. Yes. There. There we go. Old woman. Whew. Just a little longer. Darling, I'm home. I'm not done with Ilya's dress yet. Come back later. <laughs> Every year it's always the same. You're spoiling them grandkids, I see. Off he goes. I think she's left her savings lying around. This pattern is making me dizzy. Oh, careful now. I don't know how it's going to hold up in battle if Vivi's falling over don't looking at me. Be bear, bear. Sorry. Sorry, I'm not. Oh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Yes. Bed? Yes. Grandma's savings. Grandma. Yeah. How's yeah. some of that, Grandma? Yeah, that's what you get for being rude. Potion. Oh, I'm got, robbing a got blind. The got the ladder, I think. Okay. Oh yeah. Look how he climbs the ladder. Yeah. So cute, isn't it? Averagely. <laughs> for averagely. <laughs> if it was a not Vivi, averagely climbed the ladder. <laughs> 
fine <laughs> card. <laughs> okay, we've got two cards out of five. For Rosie my... Caddick is in the chat. What she's I saying. love this game. I love Phoebe. Is, what? You should have brought Rosie in here. New favourite game. But Rosie, this is already Rosie's favourite game. One of. No, this isn't Rosie's favourite game. Rosie's favourite game is Yakuza. I think. I don't know. We should do a how well do you know each other quiz. Yeah. And the answer would be not very. <laughs> <laughs> I think we'd do well. <laughs> Does Ash like cats? Yes. Yes. We wow. Did I? Wow. I'm stumbling, not Mick. Wow. How did you get a ticket for the show? You better head straight to the ticket booth in the square. You have to get your ticket stamped there before you can enter the castle. Why are you reading it like that? For God's sake! <laughs> Good afternoon! Is that better? <gasps> oh, I can it's buy a shop. things. There you go, you got 569 gil. I want to buy a Phoenix down. Just because I've seen you talk about them. They're quite expensive. There you go. And I, what can I sell? Don't sell the Mage Masher. Okay. It's good. Don't sell any of that. I'll keep it. Can I go upstairs? Nope. Don't think so. <gasps> oh, but I can. Something there. Some money. I want... I want a card. I say. Okay, we've got to go to the ticket booth. I swear you get cards early. There's a ticket booth. Oh, I think I know. I think I think the ticket guy at the ticket booth gives you cards. Oh, that would make sense because then it's on the story path. Ooh, I remember. Find a secret path. Rob. I remember. He's going to drop this on me. Can I push his ladder? Can't you see I'm working? Don't interrupt. Oh, I say. Not very nice, are you? You're going the right way to find cats down here. I <gasps> okay, this is good. I, that was genuine excitement. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Anything. I'll take anything in the lead up to Stray releasing. <gasps> no ability. Nice. Mm. Ooh. Oh, I guess that's to go to the rooftops to watch the show. Which I don't want to do right now. I want to... What do you do? Don't even... Oh. Okay. Interesting. Mm. Okay, let's go back. We're going to make sure the ticket guy has some cards for me. I'm going to play loads of cards. Those children aren't off running around. I think she's looking for a cat. Is she actually? I'll help. I'm sure there's someone around there looking for a cat. Don't get involved with the skipping rope. What? You can get involved? It'll crush you. <gasps> you... <gasps> <Okay>. <laughs> so what do I have to do? Press X in okay. time with the exclamation mark. For What's some a good reason, score? What's a good score? Like, I think for the trophy, you've got to get a thousand. Um, <laughs> Don't say that. On, for some reason, on the port, on the PS4 port, the timing is much harder. I don't know why. Um, yeah, I'm going too fast on, there. On PS1, I used to be able to get like two or three hundred. Um, on the PS4 port, I've never been able to get beyond 20. It's really hard. I don't know why it is. And so I need people, to get 25. People have to cheese. You have, there's a cheese method to to get the trophy. But once you get to 20, the timing changes. It's really hard. Don't worry, because you'll be here all day. Just just leave it. Don't get sucked in. I know what you're like. You're too stubborn and determined. No, Ash. Oh, my God. I'll just talk to the chat. A girl online says, yeah, skipping. Janita Pavlova says, jump. Will Thatcher says, we're going to sit here now for the next 100 hours watching Ash try to get the trophy. PlayStation Access says, and this will be the rest of the stream. <laughs> <laughs> Someone made a joke about skipping before we started. It's hard. It's really hard. I'm getting annoyed. I'm getting you annoyed. Can't, I, honestly, I don't think it's possible to do it without using the special cheese method on the PS4 port. I don't know why. What is the special cheese method? There's like, um, you have to hook your DualShock up to a PC. And there's like a special pro <gasps> a special program you have the to do. The what? Like a, a special thing. I don't understand it. I've heard it explained to me. I don't understand it. Where basically, you just have to cheat your controller into inputting the input at the right time and you just leave it there until it does it for you i just i want to get 
what how, how, I don't know what the maximum you I've got. You do get like when six. you get to fifty or you get to twenty you get a prize. You get to fifty you get like a nice prize. You get some good cards out of this. If you get to two hundred oh, you get, oh, you Rob, get you're really making good, me want to skip you get a really good card for getting to two hundred, like a really good card. I want to but get I promise you ten. That's what I want. <laughs> that's all I want. <laughs> yeah, do it. <laughs> oh my goodness, right. I am playing with you again. Let me in. I wish you'd stop standing in my spot. Josh Bot says it's actually impossible, and I think it is. I think it's something to do with an ever so an ever so slight bit of input lag on the PS4 port. I'm pressing. I know you are, and it's not it's not your fault. Okay, I'm gonna have three more goes, and then I'll stop. <laughs> that didn't count. <laughs> Sarah without the H says <laughs> something I can't repeat. Just leave it forever. Is the What'd gist. she say? What'd she say? She says F the skipping. <laughs> <laughs> leave it. Christmas May's challenge. Get to 25 on the skipping rope. Yes. Oh my one. God. I would play that. No Janita Pavlova. Don't encourage her. She says you can do it, Ash. I, keep, I think once I get past one, I'll be good. I got to six. How did I do six? So well. Aurelius Furious says, these three girls combined and their infernal rope are the hardest boss in the game. I think that's true. I will defeat them. Ah! Domino says, there's a speedrunner I've seen who can do this on PS1 blindfolded. I'm sure there is. If you're doing a speedrun of the game, why would you be going anywhere near the skipping rope, though? A speed skip. Why? <laughs> Just don't do it. One more, one more. Just leave it, please. One more. <laughs> it's not doable. <laughs> okay, one more, one more. One doesn't count. One skip doesn't count. Two skips does. <laughs> don't count. <laughs> <laughs> I think you have to press it slightly before you think you should because of the lag. <laughs> the first one goes fine. I'm just going to just mash it. Will that work? No. Why? It, it'll just trip up. Oh my god. That actually was working. <sighs> Let's try that again. <laughs> Gerald 112B says, can you skip this part? <laughs> get it. I get, get it. it. Very good. Right, okay. I'm done now. Good. Ticket ah, move. I'm joking. Ticket <laughs> move, please. <laughs> <laughs> this, is, this is your favorite game, Ash. You can't. <laughs> You can't <laughs> ruin it like this. <laughs> you want me to enjoy it? This is me having fun. Oh. Okay, here we go. I'm gone. I'm going back. No, I'm no. not. It's I'm good. going in. Yeah. Peak. Ticketmaster, can I help you, son? Uh, uh, pointy hat boy. Show ticket. I don't have a ticket, do I? Oh, I do. It was in my pocket. Tell me about Alexandria. The kingdom of Alexandria is a fine country, ruled by Queen Bran. What's shown today? This year's performance is the masterpiece, I Want to Be Your Canary. The Tantalus Company is performing. Here's my ticket. What do you think about that? What's this? There's something odd about this ticket. Why, it's another fake. I've seen so many today. Oh, poor Vivi. Vivi, that's what you get for trying to lie and fake. Now, now, don't cry. I know how you must feel. Here, I'll give you these. Do try to cheer up now. Hmm? <gasps> Cards. Goblin! Yes. Fang. Good. Skeleton! Yes, okay. Alleyway There Jack. we go. Alleyway Jack. He's the guy. Is he painting? Not the red mage. I think he, um, Are you <clears throat> he will try and rob you in the alleyway. If you aren't, don't have your wits about you. I have loads um, of wits. But then he goes back to the pub where the red mage is, and he teaches you how to play cards. Okay, I've got to find him. So he's in the alleyway where Dante, the sign maker. Oh, he was down that alley. If you hang around there, I think he. Rob. He tries to pickpocket. What? What is going on with that armor? I'm genuinely like, what? It was a different time. What? Uh, They're wearing bikini armor. That's bad. That's. Unfortunate. They've got, they've got more armor on their ankles than they do anywhere else. Was that they a, a are, prime attack place in Final Fantasy? They are Beatrix's elite guards. I can believe they're elite. You got to be bold to to go out oh, like there you go. that <clears throat> and be able to survive the fight. 
Hey, you made me miss, you little klutz. That's very aggressive. How much hammering does one sign make? Take? Is this alleyway Jack? No. Well, it's been a long day. And if you hang around here, alleyway Jack will make an appearance behind you. Here's the rat boy. Rat kid, yeah. Hey, <coughs> you. Shrimp! You're the one with the phony ticket, ain't ya? I saw the guy tell you it was fake. Are you alleyway Jack? Do I look like that loser? But I'll let you in to see the show if you become my slave. No. Okay. Later. So just hang here and I think anyway Jack will appear behind you. Can I go up this ladder? Alleyway Jack! Ch -ch 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 -ch. Uh, maybe not. Ch -ch -ch -ch. I'm sure he comes. Alleyway like Jack! Maybe not, no. Oh well. Oh, where did I go? You gone back. How did this happen? I can go up this rooftop thing anyway, I already know. Oh, I've already looked at this sign. Get off. Where's that girl? I want to help her find her cat. Is there a cat in here? Excuse me. Hello. Oh, hello again. <laughs> oh! <laughs> you might be able to place one at cards now. I don't want to... Oh, okay. We'll have to play. I just learned the rules. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, Tetra Master Rules. Select five cards to play. You've only got five. I'll select, select five then. Ooh. Goblin. Fang. Fang. Skeleton! Flan. you got some weak cards. <laughs> All with zero attack power and defense power. You have weak cards? Right. The battle begins. Place a card next to one of your opponent's cards. If the arrows on your card are facing your opponent's card, you have the chance to capture it. Oh my god. Right. You're going first though, so you need to sort of set up in a defensive position. The game ends once all cards are in play. The player captures the most cards is the winner. So, if you place... Don't play the thing. There. If you place a card next to that orange card with an arrow facing it, you'll take it because it's got no arrow in defence, look. Oh. Uh. There you go. Ah! The, see, she's got two arrows on that skeleton card. Oh, so she's been very so close. I understand. If you put an arrow that faces their, their arrow, you'll do battle and you might lose so you've got to try and get hang on wait i lost if you put go down put that card in in the yeah in there you'll take two at once yeah you can put that to the left of there and take it you're winning last card oh god this could change it oh no ads ah, damn that was so close okay i like that i'm gonna do it again you, no you, you, don't, lose you cards. don't have enough cards now what <laughs> you, you never taught me you, that yeah. you made me fight this child <laughs> And she took my goblin card. That was my spe Give me back. <laughs> Give me back my it's goblin. It's the brutal word of cards in this game. I the can't believe you've done this. Cards. You were close there, though. That's oh, easy. You just conned me. I'm g Vivi, step outside. Oh, I see that child running past. I'm sticking my foot out. So I think the story happens in here. And I'm sure the cat was further down by the... Um, Where? Where? We've got to find the cat. Come out here. <sighs> Again, I've misremembered a lot about this game, so I could just be completely wrong. Where's if you go cat? down, see the wooden planks to the left? You can walk up those. I think there's a, <gasps> a little boy up there who's lost his cat. Hello. I think he's lost his cat. <laughs> <laughs> Ash is so excited all of a sudden. Where? I will help you find him. I think he's he's hanging around on the roof around here somewhere. So when I go upstairs, I can I, get him? I can't remember exactly. Well, I've been all around and I haven't seen any kittens outside, so... I'm going to go up the roof and see. <laughs> What's in here? I hope it's a card. Oh, unlucky. A tent. A tent. <laughs> I mean, that's a really good item. Great. <sighs> up the ladder we go. Here we go. I hope there's a kitten up here. Ring the bell. Oh, I think you might find some cards up here. I hope they drop out onto my face so I can catch them. Pull the rope again. I think you could maybe pull the rope a few times. A little secret box of cards falls out. Okay, I've got to say, I'm not a pan. I'm not a pan. <laughs> I've got to say, Rob, I'm not a pan. I'm not a fan of repeated actions that yield a different result. Because how am I supposed to know how many times to do it? It's like hitting I the secret know. walls. I think um, 
maybe you have to speak to the character to activate it. Like, there's some character who's like, oh, they'll never find my secret stash of cards. They'll never know to pull the rope, like, you know, three times. Why, it's one of those why say it? Because it's like a little video game thing, isn't it? It's showing you, it's saying, oh, there's a secret there if you do this. Them newfangled mish tower ships float through the air, but true ships are supposed to float on water, right, Shuddy? Yes. I always imagine him as having the same voice as the beaver from Lady and the Tramp. I haven't seen that in long enough to know what the beaver sounds like. Hey now, Shuddy! <laughs> but with like a real sort of whistle on there. Shh, I can't do the whistle. <laughs> These old mish powered ships oh i don't like them is that alleyway jack up there uh, sitting on the roof i don't think so alleyway jack we're gonna battle so. i think death. you have to agree to be rat kid's slave to advance the story oh well where's he and gone that hippo kid up there i think is the kid with the secret stash speak to him <laughs> in a safe place yeah there you go where okay oh. well we'll go back to the bell in a bit there's a couple of places I haven't been to in here. So what do you think of the game so far? It's fine. Which sword to buy? I wish I had a little more money. I keep telling my son will go out of business, but he never comes home. <laughs> Look at his sad face. Synthesis. I'm taking my wife to the theatre tonight, so we shall close soon. Is this your wife? Synthesis wife. Married for 30 years, worked our rear ends off, and finally we can afford a ticket to the show. I don't like how you're called Synthesis Wife if you're doing it half the work. Synthesis Wife. You should be called Synthesis and Synthesis. Synthesis and Synthesis Husband. How would that feel? <laughs> right, that's all I that you is. You are right. How do I talk to these guys? Hello. You look fancy. Flowers for sale. No. I love no one. Honourable Lord, do you like flowers too? No. I like cards. And cats. The blossoms in Alexandria are quite splendid. Don't, no. Give me your cards. <laughs> right, okay. I need to go and find Rat Kid. And the secret cards. Yeah. Oh, that's where I came in. There's a skipping rope. No! Oh, I'm going fast. I'm going, going in there. Here. Yeah, yeah. Nice. I realise I haven't been in here yet. Hello? Are you Alleyway Jack? What do you mean there's no vacancies? Yes, you see. Really quite sorry. What? I don't believe this! I have a reservation, damn it! This guy from Texas. Jeez! <laughs> He's come all the way to Alexandria for the play. <laughs> yep. <laughs> I like the fishman. Sorry, no vacancies. He's a Texan as well, though. Sorry, no vacancies today. What's in here? Nothing. Nothing, apparently. Nothing. Nothing. I better have to go down there later with some knowledge. Oh! Oh my god! That's terrifying! Ah! Pardon me! Out of the way! Ah! I love this woman. Leave me alone! Get out of my way! What's oh, it's here? such an amazing world. I'm impressed that it's PS1. It's just such a beautiful world detailed rich world it really. fully is i was playing like block and the square heads and this was what was available block and the <laughs> square heads yeah <laughs> god that's terrible that hippo i'm gonna have nightmares about that hi i've seen a lot of horror films and none none would have the same <laughs> effect of that hippo jericho j says says texan here absolutely nailed the accents wow thank you <laughs> I'm but a southern belle coming from the States. What are y'all doing over the pond? <laughs> that was one I used to love doing the Texas voice. Someone said I haven't told you how to run yet. Oh my god, you can run. I think it's you hold down, I think, circle. <gasps> when you, yeah! When you, when oh, you, get move. out of this house. I want to fight this little girl. Where is she? Give me my <laughs> card. I need another card. Maybe that's a card up there. Give me my card back. Oh, it's only I three don't gil. care about Gil. Only cards. Only cards. Where's that little kitten? Oh, I don't know, Rob. I need to wear a little kitten. Ah. I'm sure it's on the roof around here somewhere. Well, how do I get on the roof? And then it goes into that house. 
You need to go back to the alley and agree to be Puck's slave. He's not. There. <laughs> 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 then I don't know what to do. I think you've broken the game already. Give me the. Yeah, there they are. Yay. Oh, it's good cards. Three good Goblin! cards. Now you can. Ha -ha. Now you've got seven cards. Hip all. So there's a chance now. Okay, uh, there is. Is there anything down the back? No. No. No, there isn't. Where is the kitten? I'd like to find the kitten. I'm smitten with the kitten. Please come to me, mittens. Where are you? Where are you? I want to find you. I don't want you to be hissing. <laughs> Let's do some kissing. Mittens the kitten. You are so small and sweet. On your little furry feet. Oh, I pray to meet you. Mittens the kitten. Let me through. If you have a ticket, get it stamped. I don't. Rob, what do I do now? Go back to the alley. I did. I've been through twice. Yeah, but I think you have to come at it from this angle. Okay, right. Well, to be fair, I've just been and running. Just wait a, a sure puck should appear again. There he is. Oh, horrible little rat. Come on, then. <sighs> awesome. Now for your first assignment. You go stand over there and see if anyone's coming. Oh, this is when Alleyway Jack comes. This is it now. I remember. I remember. All clear? I think someone's coming. You think? I want to know! I think someone's coming. <laughs> <laughs> I think someone's coming! No, come on! <laughs> but someone is coming! I know! you gotta, you got to get how these get, you know. They won't advance until <laughs> you press the right option. You're breaking <laughs> the illusion here. <laughs> Deliberately. Engage parameters. He's going to come now. Alleyway Jack is going to come. There he is. Ah! There Ooh, he is. He looks very Speak strong. Speak to him before he robs you. Pointy hat boy. Uh, excuse me, but is your name Alleyway Jack? Huh? How did you know my name? If you know who I am, you probably want to challenge me to a card game, huh? What? You don't know how to play? And you want me to teach you? Well, why not? I finished one job already. Follow me, kid. Yes. We'll start with the basics. You need five cards to play the card game. To play a game, approach someone and press square. Some people may not be interested. In that case, move on to someone else. Do you understand now? What? How does the card game proceed? Let's talk about how to actually play the game. You take turns placing your cards on a 4x4 grid with your opponent. Sometimes your opponent's card flips. That's because of the yellow arrows on the corners and the sides of the cards. If your arrow is facing in the direction of your opponent card, that card becomes yours. But if your opponent's card has an arrow facing yours, a card battle begins. What's a card battle? When several arrows face each other, multiple card battles may occur. You can choose where to begin the card battle when that happens. Where you choose to begin the battle affects how the rest of the battles play out. Let's see. You can also use combos. What's a combo? Okay, I'll teach you the technical stuff now. You gotta be careful during a card battle. If your card wins against the opponent's card, all the cards are facing that card's arrows are yours. My eyes filling with spit. That's called a combo. It's a double-edged sword because the same thing happens to you if your card loses against your opponent's card. Try to play a perfect game. What's perfect? <laughs> What's perfect game? <laughs> you get one of your opponent's cards oh. when you win. If you flip over all of your opponent's cards and play for it, you can take all of them. I didn't know that. Reach for the highest collector's level. What's a collector's level? <laughs> Let me tell you about the collector's level. <laughs> check your menu and go to the section titled card. You can uh. check your collector's level there. You'll level up as you collect more cards. Even I don't know what the highest collector level is. Can we try a game? Let's play. Here we go. Right. You can do this. Okay. One, two, three. And then, what's this? Ah! That's a good one. Yes. So that's got attack power and defense power. So strong. What does the MP... So, it's, it's difficult to explain. So, the first number 
the one yeah. on that card that's good. Yeah. That's the attack power. Yeah. The second thing is a letter. P means it's physical, and M means it's magical. Magic flan. The th- third character is the physical defense power of the card. The yeah. fourth is the magical defense power of the card. I understand. That's fine. So, if your card is 1P, it means the, the 1 will attack the physical defense of the card you're attacking. But really, the best way to do it is to try and take cards without initiating battle. So, if you put that goblin at the top, which you've got an, on the top of that skeleton, it will take both those two cards but underneath it. Look at how good his arrows are. Yeah, and you can. What you want to do is place a card with lots of arrows in the middle, so it's got arrows facing all cards. So throughout the battle, you can constantly take that card. Look, if you can manage to take that card again with in, from a card battle, it'll flip all the other cards around it because can I put it there you, that won't initiate a card battle though you need to win it in Why? a card battle just because that's the rules but the arrows are oh because the two arrows need to yeah, be pointing you need to try and win it in a card battle I think the only way you can actually battle it at the moment is by putting your fang on top of it and that is risky because that's going to be just luck you might win that battle you might lose it if you win it you'll take all of the card oh my god you've done it that's amazing oh no <gasps> okay, this is good. This is good. I'm going to put this just guy down. Defense. You just want to play defensively now. Okay, but all he's got is the he's a point. Try and like don't give it, it like if it takes that fang, try and defend the fang on the top look cuz it's got arrows facing other cards. You want to try oh, and stop yeah, them. Yeah, they can initiate from battles. Initiating battles and winning combos. Okay. That's fine cuz I can put this one. Can you flip any of their cards with that? If you put it to the bottom right of the that card, you could battle it and win that card. I will win. I'm so you strong. should. You've won the game! Yes! Why didn't I get a perfect game? Oh, of because you the... need to take all. But you can choose. But why didn't the combo ripple out? From the orange card you won, because it doesn't have any arrows facing <gasps> any other orange cards. Okay, oh my god. Can I play more? Am I allowed? <laughs> now you get to choose one of these cards. They're all quite rubbish. <laughs> <laughs> Rematch, okay, yeah. I'm going to win all of the cars. Crazy Murdav, this is a live stream. Yes. Don't get, because, you know, the cards are cruel. You know how to play now. You know the basics. I'm enjoying it. It's a good game. Sometimes, though, for a reason that you just wouldn't understand, you just <laughs> lose a battle that you should win, and there's no rhyme or reason to it. I, I oh, that's a good card. I don't understand this, this bit at all, I'm not going to lie. So... Hang on. If you put that card to the bottom right of that really good card, the one of your attack power should face the zero of that card's physical defense power. If you see what I mean. So you should win that battle, but it's not a guarantee. You should win it, though. Or should I not put it there and then nobody else can battle that yes, card? Yes, that's also a good idea. Oh, you just won. Oh, I don't no, understand. They, because he's gone in there with a card look that's this is tight you've won yeah. it amazing ha 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 oh no oh you yeah. failed okay I'm gonna steal try that and card. defend that card in the middle you don't want which one my horse man just you know he's got an arrow facing bottom left you want to try and avoid him initiating a battle with that card now because if he wins that card for a battle it will flip all the cards around it because it's got arrows pointing everywhere just don't let him attack that card basically so put it there defend yeah that's a actually good move. let's put the flan there and then there's less yes attacks you that want him to avoid see he can't do anything now you put that in the top and you can take that flip that goblin yes that. yes you smash that that was a, a massive win almost a perfect if i you... want that goblin thing the hairball the hairball give it to me <laughs> that is a great card that's a great card a yeti and a rematch i'm gonna clean out your cards <laughs> this is gonna be the rest of the stream now we haven't even seen a single moogle yet <laughs> it's 10 to 5. <laughs> uh, we will carry on you choose the the, the yeti your yeti you have chosen yeti, yeti. yeti's in there so the yeti's got a magic attack look so when you attack with the yeti it will, it will attack the second defensive number yeah of your so opponent. the one on the end because he has magic defense as well so i've also, got a physical attacker and a magic attacker now the good strategy i find is to find a card that's weak but with lots of arrows and put it in the middle and it gives you something that you can always battle and flip other cards that are joined to it like there so it's, yeah so he's taking it now but if you can flip that card back you will then win that other orange card 
Not for that one. Okay. Why do you get? Oh, I don't understand. Oh, well, I do. I just. I mean, oh. <sighs> like yeah, I think that's it. Nice. Sorry, why didn't I get that top one? What top one? The skeleton. Because you fought the goblin, and that goblin is not linked to that skeleton. You only will flip the cards that the arrows are pointing to. Right, okay, I think I've misunderstood. There we go. Uh oh. Yeah. Ah! It's bad now. Yeah, this is not it's good bad. for me. It's actually very bad. Um, don't take my cards! It's take, no, it's, it's not fun anymore! Back. No! <laughs> it's going to take the Yeti back, I think. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to play one more. To try and <laughs> <laughs> I want the Yeti back. I am enjoying this. I like this. Oh my god, the the card, look, it's it's evolved the bottom one to an X. See down the bottom? Yeah. Its number has changed from a P to an X. The X means Magic it, and physical. it will just attack the weakest defensive value. Oh yes. So when you when your cards win battles, sometimes they get stronger. That's so good. Well done. Iron Eye. <laughs> you don't want to lose that card now. If you lose this game, it will definitely take your Iron Eye. So a good first move to play is to that goblin there, but look at the arrows and think about where you can then battle that. I think there, because then that's it, there's, still, there's an arrow on every so area. Have you got cards that can then initiate battles with it? Is the key thing. Yeah. He's lost that battle anyway, so play a defensive. So you can't. You've got nothing that can battle it from underneath. You've only got one card that can battle it from the bottom left. You've got three that can battle it from the top. And your Ionite can battle it from the top right. Yeah. So that's sort of like, that should be your last play, I think. But then if he goes there, it's potentially in trouble. Oh, I don't know. I don't At know. the moment, you, you just need to play sort of defensively <laughs> because you, you own all the cards on the board at the moment. Here he comes. In Yeti! With the, so if you take the Goblin now, actually, you won't flip. I could put the Yeti. But you want to try and, oh, if you battle the Yeti, that's dangerous, though. So what should I? Oh, I should just try and flip the. Or Yeti. you know, you don't even have to battle if you can find a way to take cards without. Have you got anything that's got an arrow facing up? No, you've not. No. Should I battle the goblin, or should I do that with my iron eyes? I feel like it's too soon to play If you the put iron the iron eye in there, he could still battle the goblin. If your iron eye is linked to the goblin, then he can easily flip your iron eye in a future battle. So I. Oh I'd, wait. I'd yeah. play your iron eye last. Oh my god, if my iron eye goes. But you want to. You've got to hope that he doesn't take that top right corner where you're, that's the only place your Iron Knight can actually battle that goblin. I've made a mistake. <laughs> <laughs> ah! Um. Oh no, that's not that's where you wanted him to go. Incredibly bad for me. Right, try and try over. and battle the Yeti with the Iron Knight. That's your only really chance, I think, now. You've lucked out there. Get in the top left corner with that one. And protect. Yes. Get in there. You can't really do anything now. Yes. Yes. Oh, give me Get the Yeti. the Yeti back. And and just no Leave. quit when you're Leave. ahead. Yeah. Leave. <laughs> okay. That was a good a good game. Oh, should we go through these? Right, I think I understand. This is the only time where I'm called Alleyway Jack. Alleyway Jack. I go by other names elsewhere. They're just aliases, of course. You want to know my real name? I'll tell you when you get... Oh. We just beat you like three times, Alleyway Jack. Alleyway Jack, I stole your best card. Twice. The Relentless Gamer said, Anyone else's head hurts? <laughs> it is a complicated game, Tetra Master. I like that. I love a little good mini game. Right. Oh, hello. Now we need to find the kitten. Kitten! I think we should just progress. So we need to find the Moogle. Just go get the Moogle, for God's sake. Oh, right. Uh, what did Rat Boy want me to do? Just follow him. Where is he? He went down the alleyway. No, yeah. Ha oh, yeah. He asked me to sort out alleyway, Jack. Oh, I forgot I can run, can't I? Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. There he is. <laughs> Sorry, I keep doing that. <laughs> Don't fall behind. Oops, I'm looking at the poster. Stop. Okay, here we I'm coming. Into the... S oh! <laughs> oh, boy. <laughs> Please. <laughs> yes. We're 
Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Okay. It's very dangerous. You go first. <laughs> I love this kid. Oh! Yeah, Moodle time. Hello. Sorry about that, Koopo. That's Koopo. He's a Moogle. Koopa. And this is slave number one. Oh, we're the first slave at least. Try to get along, okay? Koopo, please meet you. Oh, i sorry. I enter you in Moogle Diary. If you want to save game, just ask us Moogles. Koopo. And you can regain health if you have a tent. I do. You understand? I understand. Glad I can help. I'm glad you're here. All right, time for some upwards mobility. No, how do we talk to the Moogle more? How do I press square to Moogle? Press square to Moogle. No, you, don't, you don't need to press square. You press square to Moogle when you're on the world map. I want a Moogle. <laughs> okay, come on up. Coming. But he's, there's still skin. <gasps> Here oh, he is. Oh, what a cutie. See, he's wearing a yellow coat. Ah, oh, Koopo, you here? Koopo, still skin. Why the get up? You leaving, Koopo? Yeah, and this time I might be away for a long time. I'll miss you, Koopo. No, don't you worry. I'll write. Okay, Koopo. Well, I'm off. Take care. Oh, and say hi to Mosh in the castle for me. There's a cat called Mosh in this game. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. That's definitely a yellow moogle. Yes, Koopo. Very special one, Koopo. Oh, does that mean that they kiss? Hey, slave. I thought I ordered you up here. I'm coming. Oh, my God. So you can save your game with the Moogle. There's Moogle they make a really romance noise. happening. Time to make a record already. Listen to the noise they make. Was that it? Mognit? What's that? A mail delivery system between two Moogles. We can send and receive letters to and from Moogles in other locations. But delivery has been very sporadic lately, so I want you to help us deliver mail. Yes. Okay. Thanks. Okay. Tent or save. You you don't have a, you haven't lost any health, so just save. That noise. Yeah. That is nice. Oh, I forgot. <laughs> Games with save slots, so it doesn't yeah. just do it in the corner. <laughs> Thank you. Bye now. That was nice. I want to find the kitten. Come on, rat boy. Let's go. All right, the play's going to start if we don't hurry. I'm hurrying. I've done nothing but hurry. Come on, get over here. Right. Let me guess. You're afraid of heights, aren't you? It's okay, just pretend you're on the ground. Good advice. Anybody see a kitten? This rat. <laughs> kitten, are you in here? Good. Lovely bit of money. Kitten. Oh yeah, I almost forgot. I don't even know your name. <gasps> No! Oh, please don't ruin this. Root. Oh. Beat and what? Do they team up? Does does Beat and Root team up? <laughs> <laughs> Maybe I call cucumber. Maybe. I don't know what. I don't know what vegetable energy they have. I think maybe. He's a mage. A mage. He's magical. Yeah, he's a black mage. <sighs> Black mage, like evil magic. No, not evil. Black magic is offensive magic in Final Fantasy. <gasps> oh my so things like fire and thunder and ice spells. Yes. That's good. Because they go with everything. So your name's Potato. <laughs> oh. <laughs> kind of funny name. <laughs> My name's Puck. Pleased to meet ya. Is that is this supposed to be a play on like Midsummer Night's Dream? It's all yeah. There's lots of lots of Shakespeare references in this. A lot. Okay, so I'm on the roofs now. My name's Potato. Potato. Do a Gollum voice for it. That's what you should do. Juicy sweet. Oh wait, no, it's fish. 
Oh my god, we could use fish names. Mackerel. <laughs> Mackie. I can't believe we've got beet and potato. <laughs> <laughs> Crying out loud. Well, I've got to keep it nice. I'm going to start this game again. I'm going to play. Oh, it's so good. I'm going to start this game again tonight. I can't find any kittens, Rob. No. Did you lie to me? I didn't, but I can't remember how you find the kitten. Will we come back to this area? Yeah. Okay. Come on, let's go. No, you won't. <laughs> yeah, here we right, go. that's it. I'm naming one Bean. <laughs> the graphics are so good. Can you imagine me in 2001 playing this on PS1? Yeah. Have it. I You're think this is, the, this is the most excited I've ever been for a game's release because I've, I've just finished 7 and 8 mm. and I was like, so excited for this. And it released at the start of half term. Mm. And so I had all of half term. To oh. play. It was just glorious. Divine. Who's this? That is Princess Garnet. Oh, we're robbing her. And that is, you're kidnapping Princess Garnet. This is her knight, Steiner, who you also get to name quite soon. Yeah. Are you sure I don't know the plot to this one? I don't know if you know the plot to this one. Because that isn't the twist that she actually wants to be stolen. I mean, that is, that is an early twist, yes. Sorry. <laughs> <laughs> okay, that's all I remember. I don't remember anything else. He's quite expressive. Yeah, because she's looking she's really sad. sad. She wants so to like, leave. bust me out of this party, please. It's because her mum, Queen Bran, is, is becoming evil. And... Oh, this is our man. Here's Baku. Baku. Ladies and gentlemen, tonight's performance is a story that takes place long, long ago. Our heroine, Princess Cornelia, is torn from her lover, Marcus. She attempts to flee the castle only to be captured by her father, King Leo. When our story begins, Marcus, having heard of this, crosses swords with the king. And now, your royal majesty, Queen Bran, your highness, Princess Garnet, noble ladies and lords, and our rooftop viewers, Tantalus proudly presents, I want to be your canary. Blank. But, oh, ah, Marcus. Now, uh, ah, <laughs> fortune had escaped thee. For what shall end shall thou live? For the sake of our beat, let us bury our steel in the heart of the wretched King Leo. Aye, aye. My goodness. Yeah, you gotta read fast. It doesn't lend itself to drama, fast reading. We shall back thee, kinsman. Pray, sheath thy swords, the villain is mine alone. Nay, kinsman, for I too have lost a brother to this fiend. What ho, out vermin, away! Thou darest bear thy sword before the king. All who stand in my way will be crushed. Treacherous Leo, my kinsman's suffering shall not be in vain, for I shall instruct thee in incomparable pain! Ooh, they rhyme as well. Very Shakespearean. So this is, um... Do I fight now? This is a staged battle. So you've got, like, pyrotechnic moves you can hear, use here that don't actually do any damage. They're just there for dramatic effect. <gasps> but you can also fight, then you do have to win the fight. Just going straight to the king. Are we going for a special effect attack? Needs to look good. Gotta please the audience. Yeah. Or King Leo. I feel like if I get King Leo, his friends will back off. Oh my god. The cloaked cow. Don't hang around with the commands. Sorry. Taste steel! What a hard phrase. Taste steel. That's so good. Taste steel. I love this music. Taste steel. Taste steel. Taste steel. <laughs> Taste steel. <laughs> Clamp pinch. <laughs> Clamp pinch. Oh. Taste steel! Okay, right, attack. Clamp pinch. What's that guy from um, Futurama who's like, You're gonna get the clamps! That's them, pair. I don't know, I can't remember Futurama well enough. Clamps! King Leo's getting absolutely 
bonked on the head. How's chat doing? Chat's enjoying it. Agger. So we've got the fun. Alex has been running some polls about who your favourite party member is. And we've, done, we've done two rounds. Yeah. We're now on the final round. It's between Vivi and Freya. And Vivi is, is Vivi's running, called Potato. running home with it. Come back. Beat. Out of the way. James Blank. Burlock says, yay, my favourite FF. Sometimes I think it's my favourite FF as well, and it goes to the top of my all-time favourite games of all time list instead of Final Fantasy VII, mm. depending on what mood I am in. We have to read it properly now. Tis foolishness! If I was so easy, why none would suffer in this world? This is you have to do a cool stage battle now. Aha! Uh -huh. And you have to do is mm. like a you have to do uh -huh. timed button prompts. Um, and the better you do it, uh -huh. it, the more impressed the audience will be. Okay. So. It's all about the face buttons here, so get ready. And the directional buttons. Face buttons and directional buttons. Ugh, okay, and guard, expect no quarter from me. Oh my goodness, fantastically well then we shall finish this later I really hope that might be enough to get all 100 nobles impressed that was the whole thing yes yeah. you did it nice get in there get in there who are ya fantastic performance Queen, Queen Bran, Bran was, was quite, quite impressed, impressed. <laughs> they demanded on court again no no, 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 no. it's just the same thing <laughs> just get yeah. on with it Yes, yeah. look at that. That's a massive bonus. Make it nice, rain. Make nice, it rain. Nice. It's not easy to do that. You can, oh, says you, can, you. You can get all of the inputs right, and if you're not fast enough, you can have like only 99. Oh, nobles really? Impressed. So you've smashed that. Oh, God. To get all 100 impressed. Finish changing. Beat. <laughs> yeah. But this helmet. P.U. Chat is loving that. Perfect. Yes. Nice. Yeah. Ash, the professional gamer TM, says Lucy Sobey. What are you talking about? My helmet totally reeks. My arm is way too big. Uh, and my back's really itchy. Beat nailed it, says the <laughs> Nidorock. Beat knows the beat. <laughs> that's why. The Lucy Sobey says, you're rich. <laughs> Ricardo Rodriguez says, noise. Ash, the sword must... Mashed up. <laughs> <laughs> you still have the package. I won't screw up. What is that? Our package? It's the you know, it's like the it's the distraction package. A load of bugs. Okay, we're gonna go and make her sleep. And I've got a special something for the lovely queen. Hee hee hee! They're sleeping so soundly. Very tricksy. Here we go. Come on, beat. Let's go. According to recon. The royal box should be right above these stairs. Got it. Let's go. Oh. Uh oh. The the scene. Let's get this over for the finale. Okay. Bye. Oh, what's down here? Look out! Someone's coming. Hide, beat. <laughs> oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. <laughs> ah! Anything to report? Seem to have lost your trousers. <laughs> no, ma'am. Nothing to report. Very well, continue your patrol. Yes, ma'am. At once, ma'am. Like, I don't doubt they are tough fighters, you know. Look out. Oh, my God. Is that going to happen every time I try and go the, another way? Then the stairs? I think so. Okay, I'll stop doing that then. Yes, that's probably why it's, stop it's stopping me from going down the other ways. Which makes sense. Up the stairs. Yeah, there we go. Go, 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 my friend. Oh. Hello? 
Huh? She sure is dressed funny. Uh, would you please let me pass? Examine her face. Let's see. Is there something on my face? Oh, oh no, you see. I just thought maybe you were the one I'd been waiting for all this time. Mm. Excuse me, you were waiting for me? Yeah, I've dreamt of meeting you here ever since I was born. Do you mock me? No, of course not. Then, I shall take my leave of you. Just a sec. Haven't we met before? No, I don't know you. Hmm. Maybe you're right. I'd never let someone as pretty, ugh, pretty as you get away. Yeah, he's a sleaze bag. Say, you wouldn't. Hey, what's going on, beat? I. Oh, that's what you get. Douche. Princess Garnet. Are you serious? Beat. He's he is beat because he's bad. Oh, these two. We are in trouble, trouble are we in? This is terrible. Our heads Queen Bran will have. We must hurry, hurry we must. We are in trouble, trouble we are in. Oh god, they're terrifying. Yeah, they're not very nice. The right way that is not. I know it is not the right way. Really? Do you? I really do. Wonder, I sometimes do. Now, now is not the time to wander! Hurry to the queen. Run. Go. Run. That's what they said. That is not the right way. Oh, my goodness. This not this. Run around. Carry on. Come on. Your Majesty... Her Majesty's busy, come back later. Oh, Beatrix, what a great character Beatrix is. Is it an emergency? An emergency it is. A veritable emergency of terrible urgency. Very well, I'll see what I can do. Very grateful. Grr, curse that Beatrix, always trying to one-up me. So, what exactly is the problem? Her Royal Highness, Princess Garnet. He's in danger! I see. Wait right there. No interruptions! Can't you see I'm watching the show? Your Majesty, I'm afraid Princess Garnet has... Ah, yes, she did leave her seat a while ago. Your... VV is destroying Freya in the poll. <laughs> <laughs> Your Majesty, it seems that Princess Garnet has run off with the royal pendant. Well, of all the... What could she be thinking? Your Majesty! And Captain! Ah! Oh, God. Yeah! He can be root. Is he good pals with Beat? Is Zidane? He does not like Zidane, though. No. Yes, he needs to be root, then. Perfect. Root. <laughs> yes, Your Majesty! God Captain sake. Root! Go find Garnet! Yes, my queen, at once, your majesty. Come on, Root. Root. Knights of Ruto, <laughs> assemble! Huh? Where is everybody? Oh, no, Captain, sir. All present and accounted for, sir. What are you talking about? There's only two of you. Where are the other six? And your clothes. <coughs> Why, you useless good-for-nothings? I bring orders from the Queen! Get dressed and go find Princess Garnet. If you go talk to the Queen, she gives you quite a rare item. Oh, does she? Yeah. Oh, come on. Come on, Root. Root. Quicks on Quincy says, Garnet's name has to be Cabbage. And Anshul J says, oh my god, Root. <laughs> I got the Moonstone, no. I got a Moonstone, everyone. Can I search this? No, can I search it? No. Jigatnu says, very botanical names. We were just watching Gardener's World, so I'm all for it. Yeah. 
Maybe... uh, if anyone just joining, we're playing Final Fantasy IX because why not? It's going to be Ash's new favourite game, isn't yeah, it, Ash? Yeah. Yeah. I take it very seriously. Yeah. Also, it's um, it's available uh, on PlayStation Plus on the extra tier. So if you're a subscriber to the new PlayStation Plus service, if you've got the e if you're a PlayStation Plus extra or premium member, you can now download this version of the game, which is the PS4 version of the original PS1 Final Fantasy IX. Dishmeister, so many fine dishes. <laughs> So oh, many fine dishes. What am I doing? What, what's my goal? You gotta find the Knights of Pluto. Onion Meister! Oh, I'm gonna cry! <gasps> That's Queena! Hello! She, uh, she won't join your party until much later in the game. Oh, I or like her. they, actually, I think. Oh, Queena excuse is, me. Queena is uh, non gender specific. Oh. That's good. Ah. Dishmeister. What would Queen's Meister name be? That's what I want to know. Head Chef. Head Chef, but Meister. What would they Meist? I don't know. Frog Meister. Maybe a Fish Meister, because the fish is there. They, uh, Queen's race of, of people, they uh, they enjoy capturing and eating frogs. <gasps> okay, Frog Meister then. Yeah, Frog Meister. Queen of the Frog Meister. They are a blue mage, Queen. And they can... Queen of special ability later on is that they can eat enemies and learn their attacks. Oh, I like that. It's really cool. That and pleases me. Once you've got all of the attacks, you get access to some incredibly powerful magic later in the game. Hello. Is this a Knight of Beatrix? No. Oh, I got one. Yeah. Okay, go on. Get out of here. I don't think you have to find them all. You just have to find Princess garnet basically go 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 well, I found them get out of here is that one That's yeah one. he's hard to catch this guy get back here so he sort of runs around this arena a white hood I can't see anyone at the top though that's not wearing a white hood they're gonna come back Come back! That's not Garnet, that's just one of the Knights of Pluto. He's not going to come back until you sort of leave. And he comes and runs back in now. Trying to catch him is difficult because he tries to evade you. You him. don't have to do it for the story, I don't think. I just want to. Yeah. What time are we on? It's uh, it's 20 past 5. Oh, 10 minutes of person catching. It'd be great if we could get to the really cool set piece that happens very soon. Oh, I'm going to hide down here. Okay. Okay, Rob. <laughs> you have to be on the screen sort of further up to, to initiate this, this game of whack-a-mole, essentially. He's not going to come out if you're too close to the exit. He's just going to... So go to the left-hand side. Yeah, he's going to come out now. Oh. go bottom. And he'll probably come around to that exit. Up. Yeah, no. Why is he so tricksy? Tricksy. Yeah, he's going to go back that way now. It's difficult. Rob, this is really hard. Yeah, so just don't worry about it. Don't worry. You gotta lure him out and make him go the way you want him to go and then try and cut him off. He's gonna come. As soon as you go past a bit further past that entrance, he'll come out. There he goes. So now he's gonna go to the left now, yeah. He'll okay. always go the way that you are not. So if I do that, he's then gonna he's go, gonna go, to go to that right. way. Now you wanna flip around to the right. That's how yeah, you nearly got him uh, in. So you kind of see what you gotta do. Uh, uh, he's gonna come out. There he goes. And then I want to come this way. Oh, he's going to go that way, though. And it's when way. he gets to the middle of the stairs, he will decide whether to go left or right, depending on where you are. And you need to time it just right. That you can... Yes, yes, you got him. You got him. Nice. Yes, sir. I'm looking, sir. Okay. Was that, was that it? Yeah, you got it. <laughs> okay, thank you. D don't go back this way. Wrong way. Is it not down that path? I thought I'd been... Genuinely, I thought it was this way. That's the room where the guards were beaten up by Zidane and Blank. But you can speak to them. There's a save, Moogle. In fact, that might even be Monty. Okay, go, go on. There we go. Get out of here. They're searching. Good. 
No, it's Mosh. Mosh! Mosh the Moogle. So good. Thank you, Mosh. Okay, now I've got everyone looking. Or most people looking. Go in this way. There are the crowds. Hello. Where am I supposed to go then, Rob? Back uh, upstairs. Yeah, in there. In here. Mm -hmm. And I'll go to the right. Oh, that's the left, sorry. Keep going right. You just need to basically find your way out of this. Okay, let me try going left. There's another, yeah, there's another way down the left. Mmm. Mmm. Alexandria cooking is the finest in the realm. Glad I stopped for that. Move. Got him that time! This will be the, the kitchen, I think, in here as well. No, no. Yeah, the kitchen, yeah, and the then there was there. Queen. Queen is in there. Yeah. Okay, so go downstairs. Hooray, Final Fantasy IX! Downstairs. <laughs> and now right or left here. Where you keep going down, I think, as well. That also takes you somewhere. Hello. So here's the library. I think there'll be another knight in here. Hi, there he is. nerds. Yeah. You can't leave. <laughs> Oh, I do wonder how Doctor is doing. Hello, everyone. More library. There's a secret boss you can fight in here later in the game. It's very difficult. Okay, nothing doing in there. So now come down. You should be in like a little fountain courtyard area in a minute. Yeah. We will be the laughing stuff of Beatrix and her retinue. I must hurry. Sorry, I forgot to do the acting then. I was reading. Okay, so what's it? There's so much castle. Yeah. Oh my goodness. Right, can I go in there? I think no. So. I think you can. I don't think so. No. Oh, we need the set piece, Rob. Yeah, I know. I think you're close to it. I love how he runs up the stairs. Go, go, go. Speak to your knight. Speak to oh, your knight. Oh, is that a knight? Hurry up. I'm searching for his guy. Is this a princess now that's... Uh, I want to reach the top, but at my age, I'm so short of breath. Have we all received the order? No, I've only found... Six. That's all of them, isn't it? And also, oh my goodness, okay. <laughs> yeah. I found six knights though, is that not all of them? There's nine in total, including Steiner, so. Two more. You need to find two more, yeah. And if they aren't, right here. Fatigue really rears its ugly head. No, I must persevere. The princess must be found. There is. Oh my goodness. I tell you what, she looks like the egg thief from, from Spyro at the moment. Being hounded by brigands! Fear not, princess, your this knight is, is coming! This is, this is great. Oh, that's a nice footstep noise. <laughs> Don't laugh at it! His face was funny. <laughs> oh, that's Z. Good music. <laughs> Don't laugh at it. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> oh, it's so great. Is that the set piece? There's, there's like a big, and there's more. That's <laughs> like the beginning bit of it, yeah. But now it's like a big, you know, just play. Come on, princess. Come on, princess. Come on. Here we go. Let's go. Whoa, 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 what in tarnation? She is a Texas girl, yeah. Cornelia. Um, Hold really your horses there. <laughs> <laughs> what kind of cattle are you chasing, darling? You should at least say you're sorry. I'm sorry, I'm really sorry about the accent. Please pardon me, I was in a hurry, you see. And here I am, fixing to get ready for my big entrance. <laughs> I think Garnet would have like a Kira Knightley style voice. Ah, oh, okay, I can do that. Hey, B. <laughs> Did you see the way she hit me? This cowgirl's wider than a fucking bronco. Just let me talk to her, Ruby. Come again, partner? <laughs> Did you hear what I was saying? Ruby will talk later. Bye. Where's she gone? She's gone down the stairs. Ah, get out of the way, Ruby. Ruby! Ruby, 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 Ruby. <laughs> Come on. Woo. Well, it looks like you finally made up your mind. Wow, we really had to improvise, but hey, we got her. Do you... Do you work on this theatre ship? <laughs> <laughs> oh, so she figured it out, huh? As you have no doubt suspected, <laughs> the truth is that I am actually... Princess Garnet Till Alexandros, heir to the throne of Alexandria. <laughs> I have a favour I wish to ask of you. I wish to be kidnapped right away. <laughs> Princess, where are you? Please! They've come for me. Aha, so that's what's going on. All right, leave them to me. Thank you. You have my gratitude. All right then, your highness. I shall hereby do my best to kidnap you. He's a sleaze. I don't like his attitude. Yeah, he's a sleaze bag. What are you two doing? Come on, this way. Don't worry, princess. It's my friend Sinner. Oh, really? I am sorry, you startled me. Well, with a face like his, I'd be pretty shocked too. Man, that hurts. I wash every morning, you know. Princess, this way. Everyone's loving your voice work. <laughs> Cyro76 <laughs> says the voice acting in this game is awesome. <laughs> <laughs> Princess? Oh, here he is. Princess? Maria, Maria Isabel says, bloody loving the voice, Ash. <laughs> I like the accent you put on that. It's all in caps. Princess? Princess? Where have you been? Uh, sir, I'm sorry. Princess? Hey, sinner, this is a dead end. Hee hee hee. <laughs> I thought this might happen. <laughs> Open. Sesame. So I set up this escape hatch. Princess. <laughs> Come on, jump inside. Sujan Mananda says, hello, everyone. We're about to end the stream, I'm afraid, Sujan. So you might have to watch the VOD. And that reminds me, shout out to all the people watching this in the VOD. Yeah. The VOD squad. We love you, VOD squad. Please give us a comment. If you're part of the VOD squad with the hashtag VOD squad, and we'll do our best to read out VOD squad comments in a future stream. We haven't been doing that for the last couple of streams. Apologies. Sorry. We will start doing it again. This guy, man. He. 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 I think I'm falling for you. Who is this beat? This is nothing. I've been training to escape the castle, after all. What a waste. If only you weren't a princess. We've no time for idle banter. Come on, let's move. Gave up at the end there, sorry. <laughs> let's go. I want to see the ship take off. Ah! Hello. Roots. Aha! Princess, I, Root, have come to your rescue. 
You needn't worry, Your Highness. Good work. This will be remembered as the Pluto Knights' finest hour. <laughs> Just relax, Princess. We'll get you out of here. What? You're not one of my knights. You can just leave the princess to us. Oh, here we go. We're fighting. Can I use my mage masher? No, because you haven't equipped it yet. Oh, Rob. I think after this fight, we'll have to call it. Cool. Villains. Rob. Don't Rob. hang about. Don't hang about on the... Rob. He's, oh, he's doing some good stealing. You've got everything from him. Nice. Okay, let's go. Now it's just an all-out assault. Come on, guys. Attack. He's got Sinner. Phoenix down time. If you can be bothered no. to bring him back. <laughs> you don't care. We don't care about Sinner. Sinner is gone. I love the music. Yeah. How do you know when you've stolen everything? Because it says it doesn't have anything. Yeah. I'll never give up. Give up, I say. Oh, goodness. Is this his um, title fight? What's it called? It's limit break. No. no. <laughs> title fight. <laughs> it has limit breaks. Sorry. It's That's a they band. Have, they have, like, trance mode. Oh, okay. Oh, no, I hate Oglops. Oglops. Boo, boo. Now's our chance. Come on. All right, I think we are going to have to call it there. Oh, my goodness. Even though I can tell, Ash, you're dying to play more. I'm Final enjoying Fantasy it. Night. It's what? a great, great, great game. Um, and it's available now as part of PlayStation Plus Extra, if you are a PlayStation Plus Extra Woo! member. Or PlayStation Plus Premium, of course. You can also get it. Um, this is Final Fantasy IX, and it's Ash's new favourite game. Woo! I did actually really enjoy that. Thank you, Rob. Um, I feel like it was a new taste of game that I haven't really played as well. You're just about to do, like... You know, the game just about is about to launch now. This mm. is, like, the end of, like, the prologue intro bit now, and it all gets... Oh, it's so good. It's so good. It's such a sweeping, epic, incredible, emotional adventure. Mm. I yes. really would recommend it. And it's got lots yeah. of cats. I like cats. I need to find the kitten. I need to go back yeah. and start again to find the kitten. So thank you very much, everyone, in the chat. Thank, thank you. Thank you to Domino and Oliver Bath, our wonderful mods. Thank you to Alex, who's been in the chat as PlayStation Access. And thank you to everyone for watching. Lucy Sobey and Perfectionist Gaming, AMA Gaming, OP Mules 25, Jay Khan, John Bain RKO, Otter Poet, Waved Max, all of you. Thank you so much for joining us today. Um, we will be back next week. With more streams. Perhaps. With God of War again on Monday, of course. Maybe. Amazing God of War. I don't, and also can't, can't be certain. The other the other game with the cats is coming out next week. Ash is very excited. <laughs> There's going to be more on the channel. <laughs> you can see Ash's preview that um, she's made already I on the did. channel now. Please go and watch that. With that. I enjoyed writing that. Um, I enjoyed writing everything, but it was about cats, so. <laughs> <laughs> yes. Have a good weekend, everybody. Um, we will have another video tomorrow. But apart from that, you won't see us again live now. Until next week. Goodbye. Say bye, Ash. Bye. <laughs>